Feeling down and on the verge of tears, I was originally so happy today. Why utter such words? Hey there, don't let work bring you down anymore. Here, you can switch around like this, move about like that, and even venture this way. Come on, let me unveil the intricate world of the human resources market for you. Remember the days of our country's talent market, labor market, and university graduate employment market? Since 2008, they have all been collectively referred to as the human resources market, managed by the Ministry of Human Resources and Social Security at various levels in the People's Republic of China. The human resources market, known as a platform for face-to-face -face communication and services, is a place for mutual selection between you and recruiters. It spans various industries, and as soon as you shake hands and agree, the job is yours. Before the reform in opening up, most enterprises and institutions in our country were state-owned and jobs were allocated by the state. With the distinct urban-rural dichotomy, job hunting in the market was predominantly an urban affair. If you weren't in the city, you hardly had a chance to choose and national talent mobility was almost stagnant. After the reform in opening up, China embarked on the path of the socialist market economy and employment policies underwent a series of reforms. The nation witnessed a surge in talent recruitment, with increasing numbers of people seeking jobs, changing careers, and even a striking movement of hundreds of thousands of professionals heading to the south. To handle this massive population migration, regional talent allocation institutions were established. Talent markets, labor markets, and intermediary agencies emerged in large numbers. They not only met the employment needs of people at different levels, but also effectively alleviated the impacts of geography, household registration, industry, and institutional issues on job hunting, ensuring fair competition. However, don't assume that human resources market is just about helping you find a job. It serves many other functions too. These include combating pyramid schemes and shady intermediaries, tracking the flow ratio of talents, providing talent training and selection services, and so on. Moreover, the human resources market also plays a role in maintaining personnel records. Impressive, isn't it? However, as an entrepreneurial country, our market's development inevitably faces various issues. For instance, the laws and regulations regarding temporary and contract workers in the labor law and labor contract law are not perfect. The legal protection measures for vulnerable groups need further refinement, as evidenced by frequent labor contract disputes in this area. Additionally, some laid-off and unemployed people face discrimination in the market. Therefore, many legal safeguards need to be strengthened, and various barriers to talent mobility and development await our efforts to break them down. Of course, the human resources market is not just what you might imagine. Since the establishment of the first recruitment website in 1997, a large number of industry-specific websites and talent agency websites have emerged, along with many private enterprises and university talent agencies making their presence known online. Due to its convenience compared to traditional matchmaking-style recruitment, online recruitment is highly favored, and these platforms are now broadly recognized as part of the human resources market. Concurrently, the China Human Resource Market website, sponsored by the Ministry of Human Resources and Social Security of China, was also established. In summary, from an era with almost no talent mobility to the emergence of various talent institutions and intermediaries adapting to massive talent flow, from the initial formation of the human resources market to today's diverse and digitalized marketplace, from being internally oriented institutions to becoming public platforms serving corporate recruitment needs, the human resources market has continually evolved in response to China's economic development trends. It provides indispensable conditions to foster talent mobility and the balanced development of employment opportunities. Lastly, a gentle reminder, amidst the increasing demand for labor in society, as you enjoy the conveniences and services provided by the human resources market, don't forget to put in your best efforts at work.